if you want to live sensibly, you should have contact with the earth that you live on. Being in touch with the earth can complete the health process altogether. So is there some way to do it? Yes, there are specific methods with which we can do. We will provide this uh, uh, substance to you. In terms of health and well-being, there will be immense benefits one can clearly see. The most intimate of the physicality in the existence is your body. And this body is just a piece of earth. So you're just a small outcrop of this earth. Right now you're an outcrop who prances around. After some time, you will become a small mound. You may believe many fancy things about yourself, but that's not the reality. Somehow, this fundamental thing that we are just a small outcrop of the soil on which you're sitting right now, is forgotten generally till we are buried. If you want to live sensibly, you should have contact with the earth that you live on. Today because we have lost this contact in certain ways, it gets disorganized. This disorganization can lead to disease and weakness and ultimately destabilization of the system itself. To strengthen the integrity of elements in our system, is very important. So is there some way to do it? Yes, there are specific methods with which we can do. We will provide this uh, uh, substance to you, which is being called as Thai Manno, which means the Mother Earth. This is a mixture of five different aspects, nearly fifty percent is soil. There is some amount of uh, green gram flower, there is uh, what is called as uh, organic camphor and there is a little bit of soap nut powder and there is one more herb in that. All together, you can apply this. If you have the time, the best way to do it is apply to your entire body, do your practice and then shower without soap because this will act as soap because it has soap nut powder and other aspects to it. It will leave a mild sense of camphor on the body. It is very healing in various ways. It opens up the pores of your skin. If you do this at least for two to three hours, do not apply any cream or oil or anything because the body has to breathe. Breathing is not just through your nostrils. Every pore in the skin has to breathe. The more it breathes, the more it's connected to everything around you and your energetic body will develop well if you allow the body to breathe. You must understand this, if you put any harsh chemical on the thing, by natural resistance the pores will close. This is what is happening when you apply soap, it is closing. Well, if it is necessary, your body is in a certain condition, you want to use soap, it's all right, it's not you have to be puritanical right that but generally being conscious that applying anything sticky or oily also blocks the pores. Applying any kind of chemical, naturally the body cringes and closes. It'll open after some time, but it'll close at that time. Especially if you're showering with cold water, body should open up, body should receive the water. And if you use this as also like soap, you apply it as much as you want and you can wash it off with water, you will see the difference that the body feels because… not because of its own accord, because of the way it opens you up to the elements. But if that is not possible for you, you… you have only certain amount of time for your sadhana, then the places that you need to apply is the soles of your feet, very important and your palm around the navel, anahata, where the ribcage meets, pit of the throat or the entire throat and forehead, just here you can apply or you can apply the whole thing or you can apply for your whole face if you wish. 
but it's all a question of convenience. You may be working and you may be seeing people with your face full of mud. It may not be practical, you can just keep it like this, like how Vibhuti is kept like that, you can just apply. According to your convenience, you do it, but there is no harm in applying it at least once a month or once a week or whatever it allows, entire body and doing that. If you keep at least one day in the cycle of the moon, that is one during Amavasya to Pavnami and one during Pavnami to Amavasya, that means every fourteen to fifteen days, if you keep one day where you apply head to toe, spend two, three hours doing this, in terms of health and well-being, there will be immense benefits one can clearly see.